John here, Autograph Fisherman, and I've got the set that started a legacy in hockey. Now, this set is stronger than ever, has a monopoly in the hockey card industry, but this is the, one, the set that started it all. 1990 Upper Deck, and what a set it is. They definitely started off great. Love the borders. Clean pictures. You have the uh, denim style border in the team color. Clear pictures. There are so many iconic cards in this set. I just grabbed a handful of them. There's Scott Stevens as a blue. I always love Scott Stevens as a blue. Beautiful pictures. Great for TTMs. Great picture on the back. You got your stats. Simple, but effective. So like I said, this is a set that started it all for uh, Upper Deck and what a way to start off a legacy then the you got your Team Canada cards Felix Potvin has a card Scott Niemeyer has a card flying through the air Watching the point, and here's the back of the uh, Team Canada cards. A whole bunch of information about the player. Chris Draper. And these are great cards. I guess I grabbed a lot more Canadian Team Canada cards than I thought I did, but this set also has a. A stronghold in my uh, heart being the most expensive set of the time I could never buy them but when I could buy them I enjoyed them here's the all-star cards Back of the All Star card. Stevie Y. Like I said, beautiful pictures, clear pictures, good for TTMs. I sent lots of these cards for autograph to get autographed because the. Uh, Light pictures. Like on the back, it has a team that they actually play for on the All Stars. Collectors of the 90s set of the Boom Racks era definitely love this set. And there's no question of why in my mind. With the original Young Guns. So, there's my hats off to the set that started off the whole Upper Deck franchise in hockey. <clears throat> Hope you enjoyed. Like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, keep on collecting. Bye.